hello guys and shine sisters okay so we are on day six of our training and we're still talking about identity <laughs> who are you who are you who are you i hope you are still asking yourself that question and um and feeling what it feels like you know and seeing what that brings up for you when you say who am i ask yourself that question even a thousand times if you care it is so go for it okay so in this particular video we're going to talk about the power of your choice <clears throat> um let's say for example that um you you get into a restaurant and um and you and then they bring you the menu they bring you the menu and they, you look at the menu and you just say, mm, give me anything. You just say, give me anything. The, the, the attendant says, oh, sir, we, you, you have to choose something. We, we don't, anything. Okay, should I bring you steak? Oh, I don't eat meat. Uh, should I bring you uh, pasta? Mm. I uh, I don't eat carbs. Um, should I bring you? What should I bring you? I have just anything. How would you feel if you were, if you were that that uh, that server or that that attendant? How how would you feel? And is it not frustrating? <laughs> I think it is. You have to make. You have to choose. We have to choose we have the, the power to choose and um as you're writing you know your list as you're writing your list i uh it's important to be to be very clear about what you are really really choosing it's important to 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 know exactly what you are choosing and to be very clear about what it is for you and um to some extent even why why you are choosing that particular item for example if on your list uh, you're saying that um i um uh, in the next uh by three four years i would have moved to a different country with my with my children you have to specify what country it is you have to specify, um, investigate about that country. Try to go online and check that country out. Look at the towns that resonate with you. Look at, you know, images and videos about that particular town and do some research. Do some research in order to, to seep that into your subconscious, in order to, you know, leave it leave that reality before arriving there because you will be there in spirit before being there physically so you need to feel what it feels like to be there you cannot do that if you say i'm going to move to canada for example where in canada what images do you have of canada in your head what in canada attracts you for example Choose some maybe Niagara Falls. You like you would like to see the falls. Yeah, add that to your why. Um, you would like to, to 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 see to see your children have a better education, for example. Okay, do some research about the school system in Canada and see how it's going to boost you, how it's going to help you feel feel that the reality of being in canada already you should it's important to know what you're choosing you are co-creating with god but you have to be very clear of, about what you choose note that i'm 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 avoiding the word want I'm not saying what you want, because in, in essence, the word want 
a coach taught me that this the word want means desiring without ever having when you say i want a car your subconscious understands that you want want you ever want you forever want it there's no end to wanting when you want there's no end to it the one you choose is already yours which in reality is already yours so do your list be specific about your 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 choices and um we they say the power the power of your choice that's exactly that the power of your choice to the power because you you choose what you are choosing to manifest you choose what you are choosing to experience and your choice combined with your decisions because at one point you'll be required to take action to back your decisions at one point you'll be required to, to take actions to back your, your desires and once you've taken that that uh, that the, the, your decisions and then you started taking action there the, a lot of the, the, a lot of things are going to unfold from from that decision we talked about it the other day you receive intuition uh you receive intuition you receive messages you receive you know dreams like thomas edison in the previous video like uh, you know i shared with you about the electricity you receive information about what to do you receive guidance you know, for that you need to act and one action and, act, and the action is the fruit of a decision so one action will create a chain of events event that will eventually land you where you at the place of your choice so by choosing you are designing a path already for yourself by choosing you are designing a destination you are designing a, your destiny you have that power you have that power it's in you and now i'm going to ask you again now who are you ask yourself after all this who am i who am i and feel what it feels okay mom so that's it for today um see you again in the next video tomorrow until then take care of yourselves i love you bye